Welcome back to the channel guys. Now listen, I got a bit of an update for you. I've been using this GoPro Hero 7 for probably three or four months now. Next to my SL2, which I'm shooting on now, this is the best investment I have ever made. And it's old. By today's standards, it's old because I think they have already come up with a Hero 9. Might be a while before I get one of those. However, let me just tell you about this for a quick second. I did a, a minor review on it a few months ago when I got it. And I had never used a GoPro before, so my review was pretty limited. After using it for a few months, again, greatest investment I've ever made. Now, the reason I say that is uh, the GoPro Hero 7 has onboard stabilization. You can walk. I mean, it is smooth as butter. Also, it does 120 frames per second in 1080p, and it goes up to 240 frames per second. This SL2 only shoots in 60. I've never shot anything in, in 120 before, which this camera here sits in 120 all the time. I use it for a lot of slow-mo footage. I use it for hunting and fishing. But one of the favorite places we like to go down the farm has a bunch of old cars there. So we went down there shooting one day, and while I was there, I took out the GoPro. I shot a whole bunch of slow-motion B-roll with nothing but the Hero 7. So have a look at this now, all shot in 1080p at 120 frames per second. No color grade. pretty good I thought that looked really good especially for a action camera now I'm gonna add a little bit of a color grade and all I did is I like the cold aspect of the old cars the trees the no leaves I like it cold so what I did was I upped the shadows up the blacks and that was the only color grade I put on it have a look What do you think that is not bad at all for an action camera are you kidding me an action camera i was i was blown away by the footage now guys like uh, peter mckinnon daniel schiffer josh haynes those kind of guys they all probably aren't overly excited with the footage on a gopro but me <laughs> it floats my boat and i'm going to use it a whole lot more oh by the way got something new sitting back there if you didn't get what that was, that's okay. You'll see it in another video. But I did put a message out on Twitter to Peter McKinnon. Hey, man, listen, you are the slow motion king. You are the B-roll king. Everybody tries to do what you do. Here's an invite. I live three hours west of you. Come on down to those old cars. Have a look around. Shoot what you want to shoot. Just have a good time. Maybe I'll bring out some uh, 
biscuit senders and we'll do that as well. So that's all I got for today's video. I just wanted to bring you a three or four month update with this. Super, super investment. And no, I'm not paid by GoPro. GoPro has no idea who I am. In fact, uh, Peter McKinnon has no idea who I am. But nevertheless, the offer's out there. You want to come on down, come on down. Bring some cameras. We'll have some fun down by the river and shooting some old beaters. Definitely, definitely worth purchasing. And I may be looking at an 8 or a 9, but probably by the time the 13 comes out, I'll move out. You got to get what you can afford. Anyway, that's it. That's all I got. Hey, folks, make sure you hit that subscribe button, like button, share button. It helps this video within the algorithm. Anyway, that's it. I'm out of here. You guys have a great day. I'll see you on the next one. Later. Thank you.